Uh, are you ready, woman? Hello. Yeah, I've been trying to keep up with everybody. Yes, you can hear Ashley in the need background. Somebody. And if I get about okay, one more Facebook notification, I'm going to shoot it. So here's her link. And I'll try to go live again maybe tomorrow if nobody. There we go. Okay. <coughs> one of my light bulbs burned out. Darn it. Hello, Jill. No, I did not fall in the damn mailbox. It's too small for my butt. Smart Alec. Uh, hi, Jerry. Before we do this, I thought you guys would want to see where this is at. Because this should be done three and a half to four days. Maybe only three if I can work enough today. So I thought you guys would want to see the babies. Good ball. Cool. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Cheryl. Uh, probably because it's hot out and it sets off my asthma, Jill. Duh. Hi, Cassie. Kelly. Hi, Janice. Hi, Rosette. <laughs> Okay, so real quick, I'll show you, although I'm sure I'll show it later, just because if more people come in, but before I move this so we can open up the new one. Hi, Jane. Hi, Allie. Michelle is home. She went home last night, and she's doing very well, but she's got a lot of decisions to make. Um, she's going to have to go in for dialysis every other day and a lot of other stuff. Oh, okay. That makes sense, Ashley. So she is home, and Ice Cream is a very happy baby to see her mommy. Hi, Jeremy. Let me pull this up on my phone. So I have some shot at actually seeing chat without giving myself another migraine from bending over in half. <laughs> Okie dokie. There we go. All right. So I show you the babies. I show you. I show you. So this, this is snowy and this is frosty. Those are Chrissy's mommy and daddy. Yeah, honey, if anybody walks past my house, you're going to hear a lot of barking. <coughs> yeah, Jerry, and I only have three more sections plus a tiny bit to go. And I'm hoping to get this and, God willing, all of this done today so that I can spend the next day doing that and the next day doing that. Then I'm going to do a little DAC before I jump into Chrissy. Yeah, that's what I'm about to do, Kelly. I just noticed it myself. And it's kind of close, but Chrissy stuck her nose out there. She's protective. She protects a mommy. Yeah, they all do bark at my mail carrier. Oh, by the way. She finished her first diamond painting this weekend, and she loves it. We have another convert. Yeah, there is. There's a buttload of confetti on the part for today. Buttload. Seriously. Let's see if backlighting helps, because that normally solves all of the problems. So, I'm going to carefully move this. This whole diamond painting is confetti, which works for me. There's like little tiny bits of color blocking. Like this looks like it's all one color and it's not. This through here is two colors. 
and then it mixes a bunch of other colors in, but oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. Okay, Ashley. Hi, Moses. Nice to have you here. Good to see you again. So I'll pick this up. Hopefully that'll solve the lighting problem for you guys to see them better. Yeah, there is not a lot left to go on this. It's like three days worth of work, I think. Maybe three and a half. Let me move the puppies. There's no Ian to frost me. My little life mates. I'm going to try to solve a lighting issue real quick. God willing. If I can find that big old plug. Yeah, I doubt I can. Hmm. So, before I open this, I wanted to show you I got an envelope yesterday. And I was having kind of a bad day. So, the timing was ideal. My customs are both from Evermoment, Cheryl. Both. Yes, I pull moves all over this to protect the big giant paintings. But yesterday, I received these. And I wasn't expecting them, Jeremy. And they are awesome. Y'all need to order them. They are laser cut, super intricate. They're gorgeous. But he knows me in purple and teal. I have a problem, apparently. <laughs> I have purple and teal addictions. Oh, that would be awesome, Rosette. I'm pretty sure that the bad lighting is because the bulb that was shielded went out. So what I'm going to do real quick is plug in my ot light and backlight the camera. Because that typically, when you're filming, if you backlight your camera, it works. Kelly, they're beautiful. And he's got a bunch of colors. A bunch of colors. So let me get to the plug. Because I have lots of stuff that I plug into my power strip here, surge protector, because, um, yeah, it's almost to monsoon season, and when we get monsoon season, we get lots of thunderstorms, so it gets loud, very, very, very loud, and then it scares my ladybug, which does nothing but upset me, because then she has seizures, so, yeah, I love the rain, I just don't like the noisy storms, because it bothers her. And then Spirit being the gigantic chicken that he is, he runs and hides, usually up behind me. Okay, I'm going to try something here, guys, see if this works. Did that improve it? Or did it make it worse? Let's see if that helped. Is that better, you guys? And you can see my fluffy snowflake. Oh my goodness, it's a snowflake. Fluffy, hi baby. Hi, the baby fluff. <laughs> You're so stinking cute, baby. Ashley, there's your baby. Right there. Looky, see if he'll show you himself. Yep, you can see his head. There's Ashley's baby that's pissed at her. Spooky is very upset because his pillows left. She took them back to Texas. Booker, do. Huh, crazy boy. So I almost went live yesterday and I was going to shock all of you because I actually put makeup on. <laughs> but then there were a bunch of lives and I was like, no, I never got a chance to. He is unhappy. He misses his lady. He wants her back. Well, he likes me when I have food or treats or if I'm holding Chrissy hostage and he wants to get to her. <laughs> Chrissy, this should be of you. Oh, you guys can't see her. Oh, my goodness. So this is the real Chrissy right here. The real Crystal in winter. Yeah, I put on makeup. Shock of the century. He is, well, he's not really bipolar. He's just 
when his Chihuahua side acts up, he grrrs, and when his SD side comes out, he's really affectionate. He's an odd little baby, but I love him. No, no, I did not, Allie. Um, I got Snowy first. He's the big one in the diamond painting that I'm almost done with. And I had him for eight years, and then I got Frosty, and she was a baby. And then about a year and a half later, I got Chrissy. And then three years ago, three and a half years ago, Frosty passed away. And a month after she passed away, I got a message that there was an Esky that had been found on the streets of East Mesa, which is the other side of the valley. And she was starving nearly to death and they needed somebody to foster her while they found her a family. And so they brought her to me. And as soon as I saw how Snowy and Chrissy reacted to her, I said, no, I will not foster her, but I will keep her. And that is Ladybug. And I've had her ever since. And then I got to look at Spirit, my big one. Well, then Snowy passed away. And then I looked at Spirit, but the scumbags that had him turned around and said, no, we're taking him back. So they took him back. And then I found out Spooky was a six-week-old that was going to be thrown in a dumpster. So I talked the lady into bringing him to me. And then I took him and had her arrested when she rounded the corner leaving my house. Because, um, you know, I'm like that. And then I got a phone call about three months later that they definitely were not keeping spirit. If I didn't take him, they were going to put him down. Um, we don't think it was on purpose, Rosette. We think that her original owner was elderly and passed away, and she got loose. Because she has always loved elderly women. So we think that that was what it was. And so then I got spirit, and then they tried to come back for him, and I told them, um, you're going to have to kill me to get him back, because he was so underweight. He was getting sick, and I was not letting him have him back. So I've had him ever since. And then I got a notification that Fluffy Snowflake, who was not at the time Fluffy, so I only named her Snowflake, um, was going to be put down if they couldn't find her a home at the Maricopa County East Valley Shelter. So I drove all the freaking way out there, took Chrissy with me. Chrissy fell in love with her instantly as she was coming out of surgery. <clears throat> and I guess the lady I spoke to knew that it would take a whole lot for me to leave that beautiful baby there that it was just not going to happen. So I took her home that day and that's all of my buggies. Well, mine stay inside Rosette. Um, they go potty. And if I, and I keep the door open while I'm going, while I'm not having a smoke so they can come in and out as they please. And outside of that, mine have ice water and they stay in the air conditioning. I'm super picky. Okay, so I got everything out of the tube. As you can see, it was a little smushed on this end. Thankfully, it appears that the only thing it caused was a little bit of wrinkling right here on the edge of the canvas. So, ooh, we have pretty, pretty, pretty drills, you all. Pretty, pretty. So, this diamond painting is really significant. Because in November, I almost lost Chrissy. She developed the infection that killed her mom, Frosty. And when we took her in, yeah, they are boots. When we took her in to, I took her in, I walked a half a mile with her in my arms because she wasn't acting right. And I knew she didn't feel good. So I raced her as fast as my feet could move to the nearest vet's office they ran tests and found out that she had that infection. And we finally found a surgeon that we had to drive all the way up to Anthem, which is the most northern end of Phoenix, who could take her immediately. And when they went to do her surgery, they found breast cancer. And so they had to remove two of her breasts and a third lump. And I was in complete terror for two weeks, not knowing how she was going to do. Could there be post-surgical infections? What all could go wrong? Well, when we got her home from having her stitches removed and I knew my baby was safe, I took this picture because you could tell that baby was super happy to be home. She was ecstatic that she was feeling better. 
Look at the big smile on that pretty little face. And so when Ashley and Boots wanted to do a diamond painting for me, a custom, as a gift, this was the picture I chose because this reminds me of one of mine and Chrissy's most important and happiest days. Because, yeah, that was the day I knew she was going to be okay. So this actually had to crop it down for me so that you couldn't see Kevin's garbage in the back as badly. But I wanted all of Chrissy in the picture. <coughs> um, Cheryl, there are rescue foundations for American Eskimos, specifically. So this picture just brings back that day that I knew my baby was going to make it. She was going to be okay. And that was eight months ago. Come here, Chrissy. Come here, Joker. And looky here. We have, oh, yes. I'll turn you guys. We have a happy tiny. So this is the baby in the picture. My Joker. Okay, Joker. Thank you. So this is Miss Crystal in winter, aren't you? Yes. Yes. Yeah, Cheryl, if you go on Facebook, you'll find Chicagoland Esky Rescue. And you can find Esky Rescuers United. And I do some charity work for them each year for their auctions. And they really do a lot with American Eskimos and other Nordic breeds. Hi, Jamie. But mostly Eskies because they're rare. They're very rare. Believe it or not, I have, you know, four purebreds, but they are unusual. So when the girls asked what I wanted, what picture I wanted, that was the picture I wanted. So Ashley cropped it down and she brightened it up and still no 5200. I don't understand this because you don't get much whiter than an American Eskimo. So we have the standard toolkit. Luckily, they left the cap on the tweezers today. And the three-placer and the six-placer wax Mosfa boat purple grippy. My pink pens go to Illinois. They don't stay here. Lots of baggies. Another purple washi tape. So I have two purples and, the, and I'm almost done with my one teal. They are related to Pomeranians. Pomeranians, Samoyeds, and American Eskimos are direct cousins. Out from there, you get Huskies, Akitas, um, Malamutes, and that's pretty much all of the Nordic breed animals that I know of. Eskimos are more wolf than any other breed we know of. So they are super, super, super Arctic wolf. Okay. Yay, we get to see Tiny. I'm gonna take a sip of my coffee, guys. I'm good. My back's killing me, but I'm really good. Spooky, let's go to Texas. Ashley says, Spooky, let's go to Texas. He's looking at me like, are you out of your mind, mom? <laughs> Rosette. None of mine knew how to howl until Ladybug taught them all. I bet it is going to be bigger than her. But I wanted to get hers done next. Yeah, a lot of 3865 instead. But, oh my gosh, Frosty in particular was whiter than snow. I mean, that girl was white. So I don't understand the no 5200 on my Eskimos, but we figured brightening up Chrissy's picture, they would put 5200 in her, but no, nope, they didn't. And that's okay. They know more than I do, I'm sure. Chrissy has, hi, Jennifer. <coughs> that's okay. I'm happy with it. <coughs> and there she goes. <coughs> Chrissy has little pale cream colored ears, which is unusual in an Esky. But the rest of her is super white girl. Yeah, it is winter white. Yes. As many years as I've been teaching, I know that color. But this was the day that we knew that my baby was going to make it and she was going to stay with me for a lot longer. Because she does not want to see her mom end up in an asylum or dead. So, I need my teeny. My teeny tiny princess. 
I'm making sure that these edges are burnished down nicely. And something I have learned with these over the last few months, and I learned it very quickly, was to let, let me show you. The way I have this hooked on the edge like that, okay, so that it doesn't cause any bubbles, kinks, or big rivers. Yes, it would be, honey. Oh, geez. Goodness gracious, Jennifer. Hi, Pepper. It's just in time. So, yes, this was a gift from Jill and Ashley. And I cannot wait to see it. And I don't know if I'm opening the top or the bottom at the moment. Because I know it goes this way. But I want to open it very carefully. Okay, I'm opening it from the top. There we go. That's a good thing. Oh, look at the tail feathers. Oh, my goodness. She got her little tail feathers in there. <clears throat> Hi, Pookerdoo. What is it, buddy? Oh, I see an ear. I see a baby's ear. Oh, look at the pretty face. Oh, my goodness. This is definitely bigger than Chrissy. <laughs> this is, like, way bigger than Chrissy. This makes her look bigger than her daddy. <laughs> and Snowy was a big puppy. Oh, my God. Goodness, look at those ears. Oh, my goodness. You can't tell I love my baby, can you? <laughs> Nico, I'm on live. What's up? Look. It's Chrissy. It looks like a bug. Uh-uh, it's Tiny Girl. That weird little nose. It's the day that... We, no, that's just for shading. But it's the day that we got her home from having her stitches removed. Nope, this is Crystalline. Nick, look. This dumbass does not believe me. What is wrong with this boy? Look. It's not Ladybug. What's that? Nope, that's Chrissy Chris. Wait till we get Ladybug's picture done. But, yeah, so we just got super lucky. Like That's what we're ordering next month, Nick, is Ladybug's custom. Well, I just ordered something. What? Got a massive deal on it. What? We just got a dinner box for, like, 15 bucks. What's a dinner box? Two large pizzas, pasta, and breadsticks. Oh, cool. I'm starving, so that works. Yeah, I, I needed it. Okay, I'm going to show you all this half. And then, look at the baby. I'm almost done with the custom of this baby's parents. Look at the crazy tiny. She's so pretty. Oh, my gosh. They got her beautiful face perfect. That looks like my tiny butt. Okay. Let's see if we can get it a little further before I have to go the other way. Oh, the baby. The baby. Now y'all know why I am so in love with Ever Moment now. Seeing how Snowy and Frosty are turning out. There is no way I would go to anybody else to do the customs of all my pups. It's just never going to happen. Never, ever, ever. I will continue to trust every moment. Oh, look at you guys. There's my Crystal in Winter. There she is. Your mommy, baby. My tiny. See, mommy, tiny. Okay, I'm going to close this half. And then, oh my goodness, girls, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. It looks exactly like her in, in that picture and in real life. And she's got such a happy face. Such a happy baby face. She was happy to have those stupid stitches home and be allowed to run around because she was not allowed to play until they got the stitches out because they were afraid it would tear. Because they had to remove two of her nipples, 
and a third lump. She had some hardcore stitches. I have pictures. <clears throat> it was terrifying the way they had to cut her whole belly open. So I spent two weeks just holding her and praying constantly and giving her medicine and trying to get her to eat anything I could because she did not want to eat at first. And we found out that the only thing she would eat was Braunschweiger, which is liver. And she would not eat puppy food. I could barely get her to drink water for a couple of days. It had to be cool water and it was only out of a cup. She would not go to the bowl. Um... So I was thrilled this day because we got home and fixed her a big steak and she mouthed down on it and her puppy food. Yeah, Jamie, Ever moment is, oh my goodness. And they don't do just customs. They do some pre-made diamond paintings. In fact, Ashley just unboxed three or four of them this morning. So if you go on her channel, you can see her replay of her live stream from this morning and see some of the stuff that is not custom images from them. They are, as far as I've ever seen, only squares. And I've been told they have no desire to mess with rounds. And my big custom is my first, my second square. I did Revealing Woman by DAC. It was like five. Oh my goodness. Why well, had to go to the mailbox? I didn't know. <laughs> Okay, Cassie. Um, it was only my second square, and I jumped into a 60 by friggin' 80 like a crazy woman, and it's been an absolute joy to work on the entire time. It has been a joy. And it's made it to where I love squares as much as I ever loved rounds. So now I am still doing what I started out doing, and that was just look at the image. If I love it, I don't care if it's a square or a round. If I love the diamond painting, that's all that matters. But I'm no longer as slow with squares as I was. I'm almost as fast as I am with rounds. Okay. I took you tiny. And oh my goodness, it is as sticky as any ever moment that I've gotten. Their drill quality is phenomenal. If you've never had an Ever Moment and you, you love DAC, seriously, Ever Moment definitely rivals DAC. Their drill quality and their canvas quality are stunning. When I get finished opening this and I will turn it around and show you the drill fields, you can see how ridiculously clear their symbols are. Dear little toes. Oh my goodness. We see baby toes. The puppy toes. I took her. Got mommy tiny toes. Yeah, y'all, I you'd never know I love my puppies at all, would you? <laughs> Not even a little. Because I don't talk to them constantly, feed them better than most of you eat. Um Feed them better than I eat because I care about them. They are my puppies. My babies. Okay. Ooh. You need me to be slower with squares? Well, I'm sorry. I'm going as slow as I can. Okay. Let me get this where you can see that toes is. See, puppy toes. Tiny baby toes. Okay. Let's see if I can get it where you can see. Um, let me do something here. I have an idea. Whoa, do not do that, Mother Chucker. No. Yeah, it's sticky, y'all. <laughs> it just tried to get attached to my freaking easel, but it's still fine. Thank goodness. It wanted to get started now. <laughs> but my thing was, I've had to do, working on my custom, my first custom that I call Life Mates, has been without them there. And it's been hard that way because I look at it and I'm joyful because I can see them, but it, I'm sad because I miss them so much. But I wanted to be able to do the other babies with them here with me. Okay, so now I'm giving you some information here, which I couldn't give you before. 
as complicated as that sounds, I couldn't do it. I just got to find that doggone lit. All right. So this is a 50 by 80. Y'all know I love the giant diamond paintings. I have issues. I do. So this one's a 50 by 80. <coughs> it is 36 colors. Let me peel this corner up so you guys can see how clear their symbols are. I have had zero problems. Because I know there are a few people in here who have not had an ever moment. Their symbols are beautiful. I only, on the big one, I only had two symbols that were close enough to each other that I needed a light pad. And beyond that, it's been no issue at all. There's a tiny girl. Hmm. Surprisingly. You know, mine do too, Jamie, but I've learned how to brace with my pinky as I'm putting... Here, let me show you. I'll grab a drill pen. I've learned to go like this as I'm placing the drills, and it helps me control the shaking, and then I can shift them. My favorites are definitely equally DAC and Ever Moment, and Ever Moment's probably a little above that because I can get customs of my babies. Um, because the symbols that I had trouble distinguishing are all up in here in the middle where the light pad doesn't reach. <laughs> That's why. Goofball. If you've noticed the size of the paintings I do, hello, I'm crazy a little bit. And that is all the mail that we had today. The rest was junk mail, so I walked all the way down there in the heat for nothing. <clears throat> so why don't we go out while I have a cigarette and a little bit of coffee and we can come back and that way whoever wants to stay and look at the drills with me are more than welcome to. So that I can show you guys that Ever Moment drills are amazing. Yeah, but you... Oh my gosh. Jill, I'm going to show up in Minnesota and beat you. Keep smart mouthing. Watch what happens. I've not run into eights and Bs together, but yeah, that would give me an issue. <coughs> it's... Okay, there's one of them. I don't know if they're both on this diamond painting. Okay. All right. So like the nine, the 939, this eye looks almost exactly like, nope, it's not on this one. The other one's not on this. Hold on. Let me grab my other sheet. Stay phone. Okay. I'm stuck to the bag of baggies. Lovely. That proves it's hot in Phoenix, right? I'm getting my thigh stuck to everything. I gotta take the flipping cover minders off of it for a sec. Because I use them not just to hold my cover, but also to hold my schematic in place so that I have no problems seeing what I'm doing. All right. Get my bony ass up here. Okay. So it was the eye for the 939. It's hard to distinguish. From a couple of things. This little crosshairs symbol and the 939, which is the I, and then this no symbol are hard to distinguish on the canvas. For some reason, it's hard to tell the difference between them. I think it's because they're such similar color and they're always grouped together and they're grouped together with the little six for 310. Um, the only other issue I ran into is I was working upside down and I had M's and W's all in the same section. So it was like, oh my goodness. So I had to really watch what I was doing with that. But for those of you who have not had ever moment, I've heard about a lot of really bad square drills like in Huacan and things like that. I've had that big diamond painting is a 60 by 80. It's nearly done. 
And that is all of the trash. And believe me, I was ultra picky about my drills. That's all there was. So anything that even looked remotely off, I took it off there and replaced it because I know every moment's famous for making sure you have more than enough. And I'm almost done with it. So that's not bad. That's not bad for a huge 60 by 80 of squares because it takes more squares to do an area than it does with rounds. <clears throat> Every moment does customs and they are my favorite. Yeah, exactly. Peppers, when the colors are too similar and the symbols are similar, it's really hard to distinguish them. That's why I need a light pad is for those kind of areas. Other than that, I'm fine. I'm half blind because I'm old, but that's it. Uh-oh. Yeah, I remember, Jill. But it's not a lot of trash from every moment. The, the drills are gorgeous and shiny. I don't know if you guys saw how sparkly Life Mates is, my giant custom. But, oh, my goodness, it gets to where you try and photograph it, and it's hard to see the image as well because of the sparkle. In fact, I think I can show you that on my phone. Because I took a picture of it last night, and it was really, really sparkly. Like, way sparkly. There we go. It's upside down in the picture because that's how I was working on it. But really seriously, phone, are you on puppy crack? You can see all the shine on that. I mean, it, their drills are wow. Their drills are absolutely wow. A lot of hitchhikers, but not much trash. I get the impression that Huacan is really, really working on cleaning up their act. <clears throat> because they were losing too much of us. Oh, Donna, that's awesome. And welcome, sweetheart. Sorry, I was caught up in opening Chrissy's picture. But what I started to say is that the joy with this one is that I get to work on Chrissy's beautiful picture of a memory that was really important because she's still here, thank God. And I get to do it with her laying next to me and hope she doesn't decide to step on it and put her paw in the adhesive, which has not yet happened, but it came close with Snowflake. Snowflake tried to put her paw in one of them, in my big custom. She was like, but I want to love on you, Mom. Oh, I've never gotten to show you guys. My son, Nick, made this for me, and it's snowy. And this was made by one of the parents of a kid at Nick's and Sarah's and Tia's high school when Frosty passed away. So that is her, and that is snowy. I was just picking you up so I can move and notice that. Ugh. Yeah, they can pop. I've had that happen on a couple of drills, but thankfully it was not a major issue. Oh, yay, we get to see me have fun sliding across the tile trying to open a door that weighs more than I do. Here, let's let Ashley laugh. <laughs> Arr, that's a heavy door. It needs the wheels inside it replaced. So it's very, very, very hard to open. Ugh, I have flaking old mascara in my eyeball. Because my dingy self put makeup on yesterday, thinking I was going to go live. Oh, is it so you, Cheryl? You're going to love every moment, I'm sure. If you don't mind squares. My advice, though. Personal experience, if you are not used to working with sheet adhesive over poured glue, go one drill at a time until you get used to it. Then you can try multi-placers, but they're very hard to shift <clears throat> on every moment. I don't know. It's kind of blinding for a minute. 
but I wouldn't be able to see you all through my sunglasses. Hi, Laura. <clears throat> when I go back in, you get to see Chrissy's custom arrived. We have tiny baby in the house again. Or more. And Laura, the painting is bigger than the baby. It's so awesome. It's a 50 by 80. It's bigger than Crystal and Winter is. So, and I'm almost done with my big custom of Snowy and Frosty. So we will get to do Chrissy with Chrissy. Yeah, I have about enough for, well, no, I've got enough to get me through probably October with all of my diamond paintings. And that's if I keep going slow. No, don't even come close to judging every moment by who it can, honey. Please, please don't. Every moment is amazing. I've never tried a hua can, so I'm not judging. But from what I have heard, every moment's drills and canvas are nowhere near as shiny, and the canvas is nowhere near as clear, and there's a lot more garbage than you'll find in an every moment. And every moment gives you so much of extra drills that even if there's the tiniest little mark on the drill, you can pull it off and still not run out. That's why I have that much trash. If there's even a mark on the drill, I pulled it off because it's my babies. And I want their picture to be perfect. Have you, Laura? I've not gotten to try a who can yet. I've applied for the freebies on Alley, but I haven't bought enough on Alley to get qualified for it yet, I guess. Really, Cheryl, that sounds good. Yeah, Kelly, exactly. There's been so much said about the drill apocalypse, and then after that got straightened out to some degree, people said the canvases were just hard to see and fuzzy and badly printed, and I was like, I'll wait till they decide to get their butts in gear and fix their problem. Yeah, Ever Moment is absolutely my favorite company ever. I love my 21 Secret. If you want nice rounds on good sheet adhesive, 21 Secret on Amazon. <clears throat> but if you want good squares, go to Ever Moment. Seriously. Now, I love DAC. Y'all know I love DAC. But I honestly think that Ever Moment squares are nicer than DACs. There are a lot more facets. <coughs> so there's a but ton more shine. Yeah, I'll still buy 21 Secret. You can't stop me because I've never gotten a bad diamond painting from them, Kelly. Never. And I've ordered big ones from them. Not like this, but big. Not giant. Big. And I've never had very much trash. I've never had problems with the adhesive being bubbled. They've been wonderful. So for my rounds with sheet adhesive, I go to 21 Secret. For everything else, I go to Evermoment and DAC. That's, although I'm trying other companies, I am. Um, we're, Ashley and I are going to be doing a review. No, that's okay, Ashley. Ashley and I are going to be doing reviews on each of our channels for a lady on, on Amazon. And they should be here on Thursday. So we're going to, she's trying to get her shop going a little bit better. And she's very, very nice lady, it seems. I spoke to her quite a bit last night. And so I'm anxious to, to see how hers look. You like human? I'm confused, Jamie. But I think you mean who can. The hua can that Boots' mama is working on right now is nothing like the old hua cans were. She said it's way better. Way better. Yeah, that's what I thought too, Kelly. <laughs> okay. Ashley, you do know how to find the link for 21 Secret, please. They are, let me grab one. I'll show you my 21 Secrets.
Now, it's got another diamond painting hooked behind it at the moment, just because. But this is my very first 21 secret. Let's see if you guys can see it well. This was Moon Wolf. And it is super shiny. And it's Ashley has seen it up close. It's a really beautiful quality image. And that's a 40 by 50, and it came out beautifully. And I think this one's on sale right now with 21 Secret. But that was my first 21 Secret, and I fell in love with them. Sorry, what's behind it is the my second ever moment, that gorgeous Esky that, we all hear this. So I knew I had recognized that picture. And I was like, I swear to God, I saw that in my friend Janet's house. Janet was Frosty's breeder. And so she was considered top breeder in the country for American Eskimos until she quit breeding. And she had had a painting commissioned of Frosty's mom. And I messaged her after I opened it on live stream. And I said, look at this that my friend sent me as a surprise. And she said, where did you get that? And she, I said, why? And she picked up her phone and she showed me a picture of the painting. When she got divorced, her ex-husband got the painting in the divorce, sadly, and apparently he sold the rights to it. That painting, that diamond painting is Frosty's mom. I couldn't believe it. But I knew it looked familiar because the tipped ears on an Esky is extremely rare. And there's like six that I know of in the world. It was Frosty's mom and that she recognized the tag on the puppy. It was a custom cut tag. <clears throat> so I was like, whoa. So my friend, with neither one of us realizing it, sent me Frosty's dame, her mommy. So we just got another extension into my Eskimo family, which was so cool. <coughs> Crazies. Yeah, I will never, ever get a custom from anywhere else, Laura. Never. Hi, Soulful. They did such an amazing job on Snowy and Frosty, and now on Chrissy. Nope, won't go anywhere else for my customs. Won't do it. I wonder if that's the food. One sec, folks. He thought I was yelling at him. I was just trying to yell over the puppies. Food is here. Sorry, boo. Aw, thank you, Cheryl. So, yeah, I ended up with another Esky in our chain of Eskimos. Yeah, no. The only t I agree with you, Laura. The only time that I need a light pad is when the symbols are too similar on a diamond painting in one area. And especially if they're dark colored. But I'm 49 years old and I'm nearsighted. So, it doesn't surprise me. But for the most part, I'm fine. As long as I have these stupid things on. 
Otherwise, I can't see Jack Diddley squat. Hello, tiny precious. Oh, spirit, your paw is making you shake, baby. He injured his paw right before we moved here, and somehow jumping off the bed, he injured, twisted it again. So I've got to get puppy paw wrap, and then I think he may have to go to the bed. Because I don't like that he's having trouble with that leg. Is he tiny? What are these two? Or him. Now just him. Here's my baby big guy. He's my handsome. Huh. Are you my handsome boy? Yes, you are, baby. Oh, there's a fluff going and laying down in the walkway. That's going to piss Nick off. Oh, there she is. Christy. Oh, no, Bug Bug. Ashley, it's Bugga. Give me baby. Oh, it's a Bugga Bugga Bug. Your baby Bug. Aww. She's the next puppy that I got. So her diamond painting comes next. And then, sadly, Spookies is going to go last because he's the youngest. So, even though he was the puppy after Ladybug, he's the youngest baby. Oh, I bet, Cheryl. Oh, uh, but yeah, he's a bug a bug. So, I want to, now that we've got Snowy and Frosty together and we've got Chrissy, then I want to do Ladybug and then Spirit and then Snowflake and then Spooky. And then I want to go get individual ones of Snowy and Frosty as a grown-up. Because <clears throat> we have her as a puppy. I want her as an adult, too. Laura, I think it's just our age and we live in bright sunlight, so it doesn't help. Yes, yeah, she's the kissy baby. Yep, kissy bug. She tries to kiss the skin off of me. <laughs> she's my love bug. Spirit is the big puppy, but he is such a sweet baby. He's already seven years old, so his needs to get done pretty quickly. And we're not sure if he and Ladybug are the same age or if Ladybug is a year younger. We just don't know. Exactly, Boots. They're going to go, wait a minute. She has a dog with something other than white on him. Yeah, they're not going to know what to think. Hopefully we can catch him in a non-bipolar moment. That's okay, Laura. I think if I'm closer to any of them, it's the girls. It's Chrissy, Ladybug, and Fluff. Spirits, most of the time he just does his own thing, and so does Fluffer. You like Snowy, my first baby? I know I miss him. I know, Cheryl, I'm so sorry. Yeah, that's what we're going to do is get a grown-up picture of Frosty, too, because that's her baby picture. And then if I run out of customs after that, I'll get Chrissy's baby picture done. Oh, thank you, Amanda. Oh, you're awesome. Thank you. It's wonderful to have you in the family. Shockingly, guys, the diamond painting that's coming on Thursday is not a puppy or a wolf. <laughs> they were out of the fox. Otherwise, it would have been a fox. But it is something that was close to my heart for a really long time. Oh, you must be tired, Soulful. Amanda, check out Ashley's DPs and unboxings. And definitely check Laura and Boots. As a matter of fact, would all of my creators please throw in your emojis so Amanda can find more of our channels? Cheryl, they are the best. They are not the cheapest on Alley, but you pay for good quality. You really do. No, you're coming to Phoenix, honey. <laughs> we gonna get you here. If I have to go duct tape you and put you in the truck. <laughs> he 
here we go, Amanda. Here's some of our channels for our community, and they are amazing. Um, Ashley does a ton of unboxings, and that woman, when she diamond paints, diamond paints fast, crazy fast. Bootsy's Mama, she's a newer channel, and she's really awesome. Laura's channel's good. She does videos and live streams. Every Monday, we have a live stream from Laura. And I almost forgot, Laura. I'm sorry. All hail the pickles. <laughs> you want to ride in someone's pocket, Cheryl? I bet the puppies would love you. And Peppers is awesome fun. <clears throat> We are a very close-knit community, and we all pretty much watch out for each other. Hi, Rajul. <coughs> we are very lucky to have the community we've got. We really are. I mean, me, I would only have three DACs if it weren't for my awesome friends in the community spoiling me for my birthday. She's home, Rajul. She's home. She still has a lot of tough stuff ahead of her with dialysis, but she is home. Oh, thank you, Amanda. Well, I wanted to, to show you some other channels that you can go and enjoy. We are, it, it's a great community and we all do different kinds of diamond paintings. When I get in a mood to cross stitch, I'll probably do a whip and chat on a cross stitch or maybe some knitting, but my channel will be 99.9% diamond painting because I have another channel that's my cross stitch and knitting. Hi, Glitter Angels. Yeah, she's home. She's going to have to go in every other day for dialysis, but you should have heard <laughs> ice cream was playing with her trying to be a blanket thief and I. she sounded almost like a mouse. It was so cute, a squeaking, squealing mouse. It was awesome. She's just, a, ice cream is a cutie, and she missed her mommy so bad. So I'm going to take y'all back into the air conditioning before I die out here. And show Laura and the few that have come in the new custom of Chrissy. So you guys can see teeny tiny girl. Way bigger than she really is. It's awesome. Okay, let's set you down. Sorry about the jostling, guys. I sorry. There we go. Plug you in. Climb up in the bed like a normal human being. Okay. So Ashley and Boots' mama got together and got this done for me of Chrissy. Okay, Ashley. Hi, Pirit. My big happy puppy. You got sore toes, huh? And they got it done <clears throat> in a 50 by 80. So, yeah, it's way bigger than Tiny Butt is. I mean, the whole painting, this whole thing down here are her paws. And way up here are her little ear tips. Honey, they are $20 on Hobby Lobby at the moment if they're still on sale. So, yeah, that picture is this baby right here. He's teeny girl. She is the sweetest little girl. She's nine and a half years old come next month, and she's such a sweetie. So I figured we'll go ahead and check our drills, make sure we've got all 36 colors while we're all sitting here. Yeah, it's going to be Laura. Okay, I'll do it. Because I know Laura loves my babies too. Wait till you see the job they did on. They got each individual little bit of tail feather in there. And little ear feathers. And you can see she's happy. This is the day she got her stitches out from her emergency surgery. So it was the day I knew she was going to be okay. Laura, look. Look at the baby. Hmm. 
No, this one is happy because she's still here. She is still with me. So this diamond painting is just pure happiness. It's my other one that is because they're not with me anymore. They just, they had to go wait with my dad in heaven. And I had trouble saying anything like that before I started their custom because I just couldn't handle that they weren't here. And doing that custom has really, really helped me to not be so in pain about them not being able to be here alive with me because now I can see them. And that was the big issue is I couldn't see them any bigger than two inches and it was just breaking my heart. But this one is of my baby that is still here so that I can do it with her with me. And that's Ladybug right there. Here's a bucka, bucka, bucka. Okay, Allie. It hurts, but I'm doing, I'm doing okay today. I really am doing all right today. Okay, let me set this over here because I want to show Laura. She wasn't here, and I'm pretty sure Amanda wasn't either, and a few of you. I am looking at three to three and a half days to completion. Let me tilt you all back. Just a little bit. Okay, there we go. There they are. They're snowy. He's the big guy. My big giant boy. And this is Frosty when she was six months old. So all I have left is this tiny little bit right here, which isn't much. And then this strip and this strip across. So three to four days and that one will be finished. Tasty there, babies. Oof, got mommy in the bed. Ow. Hi, sugar. Oh my God, you guys. She, little, tiny baby. Picked this big, huge pillow up and brought it up in bed by herself. It is, it's beautiful. They did the most amazing job I could ever have imagined. It is just stunning, and I absolutely love it. Oh, yeah. We've already got the poppy wall going pretty good over here. The cross stitch with the whitewashed oak frame is of Snowy, Frosty, and Chrissy. And it's got their hair in the individual hairs because I had hair from brushing them <coughs> that I kept to have turned into yarn. So that has their actual hair in it. And then you've got Wanderer underneath. And my needle point of Winnie the Pooh is going to move, as are the other two small ones. And we're going to have puppies everywhere. They will be everywhere. But Wanderer only has a little bit of background left to go on it. So the whole room, guys, is wolves and pups. It's crazy. It, and I'm not even done filling it up. Okay. I'm, let go of the cord. Okay. There we go. So here you have Wolf Green Catcher. It's not been done yet. It's just hanging up there. And next to it on light is my other 21 secret that you can't really tell it's a dream catcher with two views of a wolf in it hold on let me be a contortionist there you go and then there's my cream colored wolf behind it that isn't done yet from hankins and what's the other one behind it oh my Over the Rainbow Bridge with the Esky on it is behind it. And you guys saw Moon Wolf. And behind it is my other Esky, my other Esky that was sent to me. So, yeah, my whole room will be basically white puppies. And I'm good with that. Because I already live with all the white puppies. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now you guys can see Fluff. Everybody's like, let me see the puppies. There's Snowflake. She looks like a tiny snowy. Fluffers. 
Snowflake, baby. She's ignoring me. Fluffy Snowflake. Fluffers. Hey, spoiled. Come here. Fluffers. Fluff, fluff. Oh, she's going to growl at Spirit in a second. Watch this. There's a fluffer. Come here, baby. There she is. There's our no flake. Yes. And our period. Oh. Yep. Yes, babies. Oh, thank you, big guy. Thank you. Oh, I know, love. Oh, there's a baby. Are you taking over the camera, spirit? <laughs> It's puppy love. Okay, mommy, go in it. Okay, all right, Fluff. Yes, it's a very special one, Laura. When Frosty passed away, the dad of my kid's friend, who is a woodworker, asked for some pictures of her, and he custom made this of her. And then Nick did this one in scratch art of Snowy. Just special. So they are literally over my head. Aww, Amanda. No, that's okay, Moses. I am really happy. Um, all three of the ever moments I've gotten have been amazing. Yeah, fluffers and puppy loves, and there's Ladybug. Here's my little street puppy. She has seizures when there are loud noises that frighten her. But most of the time, she's fine. And then we have Creasy Tiny, the baby that the custom came up today. Where's my baby? Where's my Tiny? She just pulled this full-size pillow up on the bed with her teeth so that she could lay on it on the bed. I'm not kidding, y'all. Look at this. It was on the floor at the base of my bed because she she and Spirit like to lay on it. Look at that. She pulled that doggone pillow up on the bed to lay on it with her teeth. She only weighs like 15, 16 pounds. She's tiny. Hi, creative Grammy. She is a tiny girl and she pulled that damn thing up onto the bed. You're that crazy baby, huh? Yeah? <laughs> she nods her head. <laughs> Kelly, I will happily take that blame. Yay, it's all my fault. Kelly, I'm dying to know what picture you ordered. It's killing me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Ashley. Yeah, I guess she did, Amanda. Hi, honeydew. My second custom arrived. Is the baby tiny? Well, is she not tiny now? In the picture. She's tiny in real life. But she turned into a 50 by 80. <laughs> She's literally paused to ears that big on this. You're such a pretty girl. Are you adorable? Is Chrissy adorable? Yes, you are. You know it, don't you? Awesome. For rounds, they are absolutely amazing. Especially if you're like not having... You know, fifty to eighty dollars to spend on Daisy. They're sheet adhesive, not poured glue, but I really love them. Their drill quality is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And my big custom is almost done, honey. I've got about three days worth of work left to go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I was looking at that one too, lady. That's a good size. That's what size Moonwolf is. Oh, yeah. Those were two I had been looking at on there and just waiting till I had the money. You don't have a channel. Do you want me to show these or no? Oh, 
that's awesome, honey. I saw the unboxing. I'm just waiting to see how it goes. No, she bought herself a couple of diamond paintings on 21 Secret Boots. Take a damn breath. Well, Amanda, thank you for coming in. I'm just going to go through drills now. Okay, so Kelly ordered these two. Let's fix the lighting problem here, apparently. <laughs> I don't know if it'll show it right. With my glasses on, I can't tell. Let's see. Will it go this way better? No, it won't go that way at all. Let's try doing this. Did you please listen, phone? It would be nice. Okay, let's try turning down the brightness and see if that helps. Yeah, that did. So she ordered this one from 21 Secret Boots. Ha ha ha, dolphins. <clears throat> and this one, which is one of their more pretty ocean scenes. They're absolutely beautiful. Okay, so let me pull this back up on my phone so I can see chat while I check drills to make sure we have all the colors. I'm sure we will have, but this way we can confirm. But there's, I love them. They're awesome. Yeah, Kelly lives near the ocean, so I'm not surprised that she absolutely loves dolphins. We have lots of that color. Ooh, I have a new color. Oh, it must be on her tongue. Here's a pretty pink for Chrissy's tongue. That's just about the color of her tongue, too. Don't even like... I'm not in that mood. Why do they keep opening up? Why do you have lighting problems? The puppies keep opening the doggone curtains to look out and bark at the idiots next door. Uh-oh. Really, Ashley? That's not good. <laughs> I love the ocean, Kelly. I just can't take the humidity with my lungs. That sucks, Ashley. You need to make sure. Find out. Okay. Hey, do you want some pie? Yeah, as soon as I'm done with my video, please. I'm not going to sit and eat in front of mine. Oh, it's on the table. Thank you. Oh, good idea, Ashley. Oh, this must be in the bucket behind her. Is there was a, my husband had a big mess in the house and we had to cut out a lot of it because there was a Home Depot bucket. I was like, seriously, dude, are you on drugs? Why do you have this crap in my house was kind of the discussion. We have a shed, put it out there. Yeah, okay. Need a pen to write with. Right there. Yeah, knew I kept one in there. What's the blue one? Okay, Snowflake. Are you grumpy or what? I'm trying to figure out what the blue is in it. I don't know. But we'll find out. I wish that Facebook would leave me alone today. I'm about ready to shut it off. It's really aggravating the crud out of me. Lots of 762. Lots of 3865. And 3756. So those are our three primary colors, apparently. Ay, ay, ay. I should just let you guys go and do inventory. But I wanted you to see... The drill quality, because darker colors are usually what people say are problematic. But I've not had any issues at all. None. 
The drills are shiny. They have flat backs. There's very few hollow drills that I've gotten in my other one. And I need some light or I can't see is the problem. Okay, let's try it that way. Whoa, I, light, no jumping off. That is not allowed. You're too doggone expensive. All right, let's try that. Okay. Yeah, the drills look really good, guys. They look super good. Hi, she wanna. Just trying to get you guys where you can see better. But yeah, their drills are really beautiful. I'm surprised there's not much 939. Oh no, I'm not. There it is. I see. It's like under my piano. <laughs> we have lots of 840. That's the tile from my house that I had before this. <clears throat> Is where the browns are coming in. Still don't understand all the blue, but I will when I get into it. So let's see. Yeah, we have lots of 3756, which is a super pale green. But I found out that on Snowy and Frosty, it really does read white from a distance. So it doesn't bother me at all. Okay, honey, I'm going to jump off here in just a minute. Because I need to concentrate and go through all these drills. And I don't think you guys want to be sitting here while I count the drills. I mean, if you do, let me know and I'll just count them while you're here. But... <coughs> It's up to you guys. I even though it's ever moment, especially because it's AliExpress, you know, they don't have a lifetime guarantee like DAC does. But from what I understand, if you do run short, they will make it right. So I'm not particularly worried. I just hate to have to go through that if it's avoidable. I know you need to know, honey, but you're usually on the phone with me about 10 hours a day. They really nailed the colors that were in that tile. I loved that house. I'm still pissed at him over the, about that house. Probably will be till the day I die. Oops. That's eight four. Okay. That was hard to see because it had white. Really? Is that all of it? You got to be kidding me. Okay, I got a snoop, y'all. Because I had almost no 310 in my other one. No, that's not all of it. <laughs> that's not even close to all of it. I had one little bag of 310 in my other one. But there's some black in the background on this one. So that's all the 310 I have for this painting. That's not bad. I got... Way more than that in Swan Lake and Wanderer. Shut up. I already know you're going to say it. Oh, that's awesome, Kelly. I've been worried about you not sleeping, sweetie. I've been very worried about you not sleeping. That scares me. Because <clears throat> you're trying to do an awful lot on almost no sleep. Okay, so... This should be all there is a 321. That's one of my favorite reds ever. So 44. Yeah, there should be more than enough in here. One, two, three, four. Five, 20. 640. Yeah, that should be good. No, Boots, I don't. You just want me to smack the crap out of you. I'll do it. It's a beautiful image. But only after I get bored. It would go to the bottom of the pile right behind, um, yeah, Brain Dead, uh, Swan Lake. Because I have other images that come first. Like these. That's all 840. I know there's going to be more of that in there. Okay, I'm getting poked by the drills here. That's not fun. So we have... 
four little bags of $7.91. There's the other $9.39. I knew there had to be more. Okay. <sighs> oh, geez. Only 218 drills needed of this color, and they sent me four bags of 160. Pretty nice ratio there, if you ask me. Uh, it's going to be 104 here today, Donna. I understand how you feel, sweetheart. <clears throat> I really do get it. It's awful weather right now. But at least it's not humid here. It really is not. I can deal with it if I'm not trying to breathe through moisture. Because that's hard to do. Let me tell you. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, I'm hoping they sent more than that of that. Really am. Okay, that's cutting it awful close. Sixty four hundred. It should be about seventy six hundred of these. Yeah. That one's good. Okay. But I am concerned about the 3865 being enough. Seeing if there's more. Yes. Okay, good. Now I can take a breath. I was like, uh, that looks like it might be short a few drills. Ah, <sighs> 1632. 4800. Yeah, okay, now we're okay on it. That scared me. Because that requires a lot of that color. Yeah, Karen, that's why I can't be there. I have bronchial asthma. I can't do it. Okay, 37.22. Yep, that should be just fine. <clears throat> I still think there's going to be more of those. And it looks like that's all of these. Lots of 712. That's 543. That's really tell the difference. That is really hard to tell that difference. Okay. 8, 16. Almost 32. <laughs> I'm not quite. 24. 32. So that would be 4,420. No, that won't work. Mm -mm. Make sure I can add, because I doubt it today. Hold on a second. This will be much easier in my brain that way. That wasn't looking right, but good thing it's because I can't add worth a damn day. <clears throat> That's what happens when you combine headache with counting. Seriously. Do not try to add when, you, when your head hurts. Because it doesn't generally work well. Ooh, we got pretty teal again, 37.50. 
Yeah, that's definitely not covered up. And that seems to be it for these. It's three thirty-eight fifty-eight. And better not be. There we go. That's better. Now I feel more comfortable with it. This is what happens when you have a headache, y'all. Oh, they do respond to you quickly? Is that what you mean? Come back here, please. Oh, those are two different ones. Okay, let's get the 3689 out of the way because there's only one bag of those. And it only takes 20 of those drills. So, yeah, that ought to do it. 3712 only takes 14. We're good. 3778. <coughs> yep. 450. I don't know if there's more of those. There's her other tongue pink. 3727. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, no, no. That's not good. I'm going to have to count every drill in the bag. Jill, they only sent me one small bag of 3727. And that's supposed to be 160 drills. And it requires 161. I'm going to set that aside, just in case, because I don't feel like counting drills. I really don't. But they didn't cut that close on the other one at all. Let me put these in here. Because unless there's a bag of that hiding somewhere that I don't know about, then that's probably not going to be enough because I don't have that color in anything else. I like to get my colors grouped together where they make sense. It's right there. <clears throat> okay, where did those go? Ouch. I have a drill up to my butt here and it hurts. Okay. Nine eighteen. Yeah, that'll do it. I'm blinking. Oh, shit. Y'all, wait a minute. My son's having a seizure. Hang on. He's upright, guys. That scares me. I hear seizure in my son, and I have a panic. Uh, 
Okay, breathe, Amber. Just breathe. Okay. So that's 8,000. Or no, yeah, 8,320. Yeah, that ought to be enough. Okay, do we have any other 161s here? Yes. Another small bag. I'm normally not this disorganized, but I was jumping off the bed and drove everywhere, and that's okay. I don't care. There's 939s. Where did the 414 go? Right there. Not there. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. I just need to catch my breath a second. That is not what I needed today. Okay, that's all of those that I see. Yeah. No, that can't be. Because that's not enough according to their own thing. Are you kidding me? Did every moment shorten on two colors? Send me three big bags, goofballs. I can't be right. I got it. It's right. Would have been easier just to send three big bags for that count, but that's okay. Sorry, y'all, that threw me for a loop. Just kind of out of it a second. 1760 is what should be here. 317. Yeah, that's enough. Yeah, 318. There had to be more of these. Yeah, deep brain. So 32. Apparently, I got shorted a few colors that I can already see. Okay, 452. This is unusual for them to not send enough drills of anything, much less two colors that I can see so far.
And we're down to the last three colors to see if how much more we have to ask to return. 32. I'm glad I didn't just blindly trust it because if there's any bad drills in those two colors, Jill, then I'm going to be in trouble because I don't have those two colors anywhere. I can't get on video chat with you yet. Still finishing. Sorry, guys, I've got to take care of this. Thank you, Jill. I appreciate it because there's no way there's enough of these colors. If I run even one bad drill, I'm going to be in trouble. Make sure everything else is here. There's the 3727 that don't, doesn't have enough and the 842 that doesn't have enough. Okay. Let me get you a picture. Because there's just, that's just not going to work that way if I run even one drill short. Like, let me put a little mark next to what I'm short so you can show her the asterisks are the ones that I didn't get enough drills. Okay. Here we go. Okay. There you go, Joe. Thank you, honey. <clears throat> Whoa, get back in there. No jumpers. So other than, we have all of the colors, guys. It, I just am afraid I might run short on that. So Jill is messaging every moment and let them know so they can send me out, you know, another little baggie of each of the colors. Because it's just, I don't want to take a chance. Because I don't have either one of those colors in my other ever moments. But the canvas is absolutely beautiful. Um, I did get all of the colors. And it's probably just me being a little paranoid about running out. But based on their estimates of drills, of how you should count them, that would leave me a few short on both colors. If I had completely perfect drills. So just, you know, if something like that happens, do what Jill had me do and take a picture of the inventory sheet and the colors that you're a little shy of, and I'm sure they're going to fix it. 
And if you're missing a color, then send them a picture of the inventory sheet where you checked off the drills versus the ones that aren't there. And from what I understand, they will mail them out quickly. Now, yeah, there could be enough there, but it's not worth taking a chance on those two colors. Because one of those is in her tongue. <laughs> we can't have a naked tongue. That is the closest thing to a mistake I've ever seen in an ever moment. So, not panicked about it. And I won't be starting this until next week. Probably like, let's see. <clears throat> Today's Tuesday, so Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So it'll probably be like Monday before I start this one. Oh, okay. Didn't know that. You're talking to somebody who's never done this. Okay, so I gotta get those drills back out. Uh, doo -doo, doo -doo. Okay, good, got them. I had them in case, where I could get them in case I needed to. Just in case. Helps if they're right side up. Okay, here we go. Come on camera. Jill, I can't and take a picture. It won't let me do both, damn it. Quit freaking doing that. If you don't stop calling, I can't take a damn picture. Now I'm just getting irritable. Okay, guys, I'm going to go so I can go and wring Jill's neck while we try and figure this out. I love all of you, and my thoughts and prayers are with you. But I can't get her to understand you can't call and have me take a picture at the same time. It doesn't work. <laughs> Thank you, Karen. Yes, I do. I just can't do everything at once on my phone, child. It doesn't let me. Thank you, Kelly. <laughs> I'm sure they'll get it straightened out. It's just, I would be, even if every drill was perfect, they estimate 160 drills to these small bags. So that would leave me one drill shy. And I would be 20 drills shy on this color. So you all have a great day. I am going to go have a cigarette, eat, and work on my custom of Snowy and Frosty. And then I will come back and deal with some more of this. <laughs> I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. If not, I will see you Thursday. I love you all. My thoughts and prayers are with you as always. I'm going to go try and get this picture done now, Jill. So don't call right away. Okay? Bye, guys. <laughs>